One interesting hypothesis that's been put forth to try and explain this complex pattern of dietary information that we have for the Australopithecines is that they were eating certain kinds of aquatic plants, things like sedges, that allowed them or produced these kinds of dietary signals. So one potential takeaway is that Australopithecines were simply utilizing a lot of different food resources in a lot of different environments, perhaps across seasons and perhaps depending on local availability. Now this shouldn't be surprising. Chimpanzees, for example, utilize a lot of different food resources in their environments that they occupy today. In different parts of Africa where chimpanzees are found, they systematically utilize different resources. As the seasons progress, they utilize different resources. So Australopithecines, despite their seeming specialization associated with their hyper robust dentition, might also have been dietary generalists in certain kinds of ways, and key evolutionary ways. They might have been opportunistic in terms of taking advantage of food resources where and when they were available.